Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the War 3 Champions Season Finals. It is time for the first big decision for the first Grand Final. The FFA Tournament is coming to an end after two semi-finals. Now the big Grand Final. Ten players try to conquer the throne. Only one can make it and only one person can be my co-caster here tonight. And that is, of course, Rulers. Yo, welcome everyone. Welcome to the finals. Welcome to the finals indeed. We had some crazy semi-finals, especially the first one who, of course, or which of course, saw Leluami as the winner. He's now joining Neutron and Bobby OG, as well as Godfather, the winner of the second semi-final and fight for the crown. Yeah, very, very nice met match here today. Um, usually I pretty much can expect know what to expect but today i am really really blind um, because we have an interesting map a six player map so four players playing on a six player map this always adds some spawn luck and a lot of um the pace or the pace the game uh, goes is decided by the spawns so yeah um also we have three really aggressive players a neutron godfather and bobby I'm going to start the game already. Uh, Feels a little bit like a join bug. It appears that Geo Warcraft 3 is in a bad state. Restart the game and search again. Ah, damn. Uh, you're also lagging a little bit. Maybe your machine is overheating by all the hype that this FFA final is coming up. Uh, it's really cool to see. Prior to the last season, we had a little bit of a problem with activity on War 3 Champions, but we called to arms, basically, and uh, that call was heard. The activity on War 3 Champions and for FFA as a whole is almost at an all-time high, at a very high, at the very least. And now we got the best players facing each other. I have no idea who's the favorite here for me. My heart is definitely Liluami, but what does the brain say? That's the question. I'm um, sorry, could you uh, host a game? Sure thing. Please. You just tell me what to do in terms of maps and servers. Yeah, I think EU North was good. EU North selected. Uh, Silver Pine Forest is the map. What was the map? Silver Pine ah, Forest. Ah, Silver Pine, obviously. Um, FFA version, right? Uh, yeah, you can you can take the other one. The FFA version just has the no chat ah. command. Ah. Yeah. Okay, we don't want that, obviously. We want chat, we want the politics, we want the entire beauty of FFA. And Neutron is trying to uh, fool me, right? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. No, 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 Yuri. I know you too long. <laughs> Not listening. All ready. Rulers is in. Players are in. So we got uh, Neutron Godfather, Lelu, and Bobby. What are the races telling us? Yeah, so we had a lot of orcs in the qualifiers, but unfortunately no one made it. So yeah, no orc today, but we have Human Undead and Night Elf. So two times Night Elf in Lelu and Neutron. Not sure what to expect. Um, like what are the differences in the build? Oftentimes we can see Keeper first, especially by Neutron if he's going for an aggressive play. Um, because Keeper is very fast in creeping and good in early attacks. But yeah, first thing should be the spawns that are important. Well, then let's check out the spawns, Rulers, because we got a game running. We are so on point with the schedule. It's unbelievable. This has probably never happened for an FFA. Oh, no sound. Does that require... It's probably... It will... Might require... A rehost then. If we don't have sound. Oh, now Rulers so is... So who lacking. is this jet? Is, the, is this rather Lilo or is this rather Neutron? Well... The red guy. The red is Neutron. <laughs> okay, I guess we're good to go as we have the sound on as well. Okay, you tell me everything about the players, about the races, about the spawns, because yeah. what the hell? It's... We are all closed, basically. 
Exactly, exactly. So this screams for early aggression and the lineup as well. So yeah, we have uh, Bobby in the north and on the right side we have Godfather close to him. We all know that Godfather always goes for necro wagons and he, we know that humans and orcs are the best to push. And if you look at the spawns, then if he is getting rushing out the human, he has the entire top left side of the map for him. Whereas if he would rush the elf, he would be stuck um, at the left side with the red players. So not a lot to gain if he rushes downwards. Uh, so I guess he is going to rush upwards to Bobby and no one so far held a necro wagon push. Uh, from Godfather, at least not a human or an orc. So I'm really curious because Bobby is currently ranked one FFA player and he's really, really good. So yeah, I'm really excited if he's able to hold the push that is most likely gonna come. And looking at the elf players, I'm not 100% sure. Let's take a look at the heroes. Okay, so red, no, both going for keeper first. Both going for an Ancient of War creep, so I'm not yet sure who is who, I have to admit. Uh, you can see on the left hand side, Teal is Lelu and Red is Neutron. How? Oh, what's happening? Attack. Someone says, uh, OMG, what is happening? I don't know. Why OMG? Because Night of I guess because he, he figured out that he's in the surrounds. So, ah. yeah. Well, that won't deter him from winning, of course. The favorite of hearts. The king of hearts. Little army. And I have a better overlay for you guys coming with the names properly displayed. And then we have... Yeah, and he's party. in the surround between Godfather and Neutron, so... That's there's right. no way for him to, to get out here on the left side and rushing Neutron. So yeah, I guess he is going to try to take cross map expansions, which is the other standard, like going for this expo. But I think this is also going to be Bobby's second expansion, so not going to be easy game for Lilo here. Like I think he hoped for a non-surround spot as his win condition for uh, getting into the freeway, which didn't happen. But yeah, there's still it's still kind of likely that Godfather is rushing Bobby and one of them will fall. And yeah, uh, Lilo is getting into the freeway this way. All right, so now I'm not busy with production anymore. We're all good to go. You guys have, of course, the chance to improve the uh, prize money for all the players. W3Cfinals.backtowarcraft.com. Wow, 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 wow. We have a pool rush. What? Who does this yeah. in FFA? Uh, Godfather, I guess. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, usually he's going for a Necro Wagon every time, but now he went for a Ghoul Rush. But he has an expansion up, so it's not an all-in. And he's surrounded, so if you are surrounded, it makes a lot of sense to go for an aggressive play um, so that you can get the left side of the map. But yeah, if Bobby can hold for a bit, then Lilo Army is pretty much getting this this uh, expansion for free, I would say. Not bad. Lilo, of course, multiple time champion. Neutron, Ooh, multiple wow, time look at champion. The, look at the build. Look at the build of Bobby. He skipped the barracks to go for a fast attack. Oh, he has nothing. Yeah, he played super greedy with fast tech, fast expansion, no barracks. So, wow. How is he supposed to hold this against Godfather? Um, yeah, I don't know if he scouted the position of Godfather and then decided to go for this build or do you have to d decide this beforehand? But man, this no, has... I mean, is... No, if you skip the barracks, that's definitely a pre-game thing. Okay. Man, that is unlucky. Maybe he can try to tower up, but I mean, his expo is gone. His main is under threat. Yeah, and yeah, usually... As you know from a 1v1, if Undead is going for fast expo, then Human wants to be the one pushing and be aggressive on the Undead expo, and now it's the opposite. And yeah, that's usually not a good position to be in, and I'm not sure if he is able to survive. And he didn't even chat, like he's not even announcing that he got rushed. Yeah. I mean, I guess it doesn't matter because neither Neutron nor Lilo uh, would go and help him. It would rather f make them peace and creep more if he would announce it. 
Like, if you know that the two other players are fighting, then you know that you get Shredders uh, for free, you know that you get Red Spots for free. So I think it's fine to not give that information away to the others. The complaints coming in just, I don't know, five minutes into the game or something. Absolutely yeah, wonderful. Funny, funnily, the complaints come from comes from Lilo, who is yeah. not pretty much affected at all, just as <laughs> yeah. a bad one. <laughs> uh, but yeah, he missed the Shredder, so Neutron stole the Shredder, I would Ooh. assume. Yeah, the Shredder is at Neutrons. Uh, where's the second Shredder? Like, there are only two Shredders on this map. And mm. this makes it... Ah, it's still in the lab. Look at this, and Godfather now stole it. Wow, oh, that's a disaster for Lelo. Okay, that uh, will probably require some wisps to make up for it. We have a wild engagement between Neutron and Lelo fighting over the Overlord. Yeah, and they are going for exactly the same strategy, it looks like. Oh. Only Neutron with the better spawn already gets his second expo up. Uh, so yeah, Neutron, very, very good start here for him. That's why he's the king. Of War 3 Champions, at least. Yeah. So nice two early engagements. Really, really rare, I would say. Mm. And the but Gold yeah, Rush I mean, continues. Yeah, Neut Neutron knows that he is better in 1v1 than Lilu, so it's fine for him to take some, some early fights where, where 1v1 players show um, biggest skill difference to FFA players. Yeah, and the big 100-100 fights, it's barely noticeable, but uh, here it's definitely showing and Lelu seems a bit triggered right off exactly. the bat. Exactly, yeah, Lelu is already frustrated by the spawns and yeah, that's definitely where Neutron is <laughs> picking up. But I guess uh, you remember our post-match interview with Lelu after the semi-final, I told him when in doubt just uh, think about me that I'm cheering for him and he'll probably do exactly <laughs> that and wipe the floor from behind. Yeah, and I mean, he's in a bad spot in terms of experience. No, Neutron wants to peace already. That's quick. And I'm not sure if Rulers is still with me, but he will be back in no time. Well, we have another yeah, fight. Yeah, I'm just ah. doing a lot of lags because I'm now at the... 15 to 20 year old laptop, I think. Oh, so okay. it's, so, it's so rough. It's lagging a lot, so I hope I'm not cut, cutting off too much. Should be fine. Otherwise, I carry this no problem at all. Yeah. I mean, you could still share the Discord if it's getting too bad for me. I don't know if you can run a video stream with a 15 year old laptop. <laughs> Yeah, who knows. Okay, but now we see that uh, the elves resolved the situation by Neutron giving up the red camp. Um, but yeah, I think that's always a, a nice uh, trade of you because he can just take another red spot and he already has the better spawn. So yeah, don't be too stubborn here. Um, and what's happening on the other side? There, there were some small shenanigans between... Uh, Godfather and Bobby, and yeah, now Godfather is going for the Necro Wagons already. Uh, so Bobby, yeah, pretty far behind in terms of supply and tech and expansion. Yeah, he has uh, no additional gold mine. He's not on tier three. This is yeah, really but he's, he's four three, so that's something at least. Yeah, and he's preparing for that Necro Rush to come. I mean, he should be working yeah. on a depth upgrade. It's finished now. Uh, he's probably yeah, also going for mortars or one gyro for scout, then mortars even. Yeah, like the best way to defend a Necro push is uh, catching it on the way to your base. Like if they are already at your base and you have to TP in, and all the skeletons are already here it's pretty much impossible to hold. But this is the best spot here he has. He has four free heroes, he has Archmage Panda, which is the best, and he has a scroll of the beast. So yeah, wow, this looks kind of promising for Bobby here. You said nobody was able to hold this Necro push. Maybe we have a first time ever here in the finals. Bobby definitely coming prepared. Has one more Breath of Fire, has also a scroll of protection later. Just has to work on the economy once he survived. Yeah, and Godfather is pulling back. He's a little bit scared of the Scroll of the Beast as well, I assume. And yeah, as I told you, he has to get close to Bobby's base where he can then siege. 
Um, but Bobby is doing a really good job here in chasing and... Ooh, he's getting one wagon, it seems, for free. Yeah, that's a lot of corpses gone and as well. That's a sorceress. <gasps> Very nice. Very nice. Sick place by Bobby with that rally point coming in. And that's the second wagon gone. So it's only a necro push at this point. Yeah, and it's level 3, 2 versus 4, 3. And yeah, as we said, this is looking really nice. Uh, by the way, on the other side, uh, Neutron is already breaking as well. He's on 78 supply, no gold, whereas Lilo is on 40 supply. Uh, so yeah, this could also be a lethal push here for Neutron. I'm not sure what to expect from this game at this point anymore. It is a crazy <laughs> final, that's for sure. That's exactly what we were hoping for. Um, Lilo has still no lumber, saying that he's dead <laughs> as he sees the push coming. Yeah. Yeah, he's on 50 supply versus 77 of Neutron. Neutron with two expansions. And yeah, Bobby never, by the way, <laughs> said anything. True. <laughs> oh man, this is gnarly. Expo down, just a handful of bears. This panda bear is getting wiped out really, really soon. A disastrous game for Lilu. At okay, panda yeah, being stashed. This, this could turn into a a quick win for Neutron, very quickly, like... Yeah, because Lelo, I don't think he's gonna leave anytime soon, so he's trying to hide. And then the other side might not peace, I'm not sure. Yeah, maybe maybe the other side is peacing at some point, but... Okay, now Bobby has the expansion up as well. Expansion up, 50 supply versus 62 of um, Godfather. It doesn't look as scary at all anymore as, as it was. Thing is, I think everybody would be quite happy if Lilu is eliminated fast. So no one exactly. will really be here to help him, unlike in the semi-final. Ooh, it's, it's a very bear-heavy push, by the way, by Neutron. It's two, four, I think six bears. And Lilu is getting his fourth Chimeras out. He has two already, so this could be a nice rock, paper, scissor um, defense here. But he's only on 57 versus 80, so still gonna be super hard. Finally a Shredder, more Chimeras need to come out. This is damage done to Lilu for sure after that early game, but he's clawing his way back. Can the Chimeras do a lot? Drunken Haze, Breath of Fire on both sides. In the meantime, Godfather is pushing for Bobby's expansion once again. Panda entangled and just dead will not soak up any experience from this fight. And it looks like it's a lot of experience on the line because the bears are all falling. Yeah, on the other side we have Blizzard already, so nice reskill here by Bobby. Really good macro game by him here. Uh, but Godfather also has very nice splits against the AoE. Oh, this is very close fight here between the human and undead. Um, oh, Lilo is closing the supply gap. He's only down 11 supply. Godfather... No, it was uh, Bobby losing the panda, so lacking a bit of AoE. And the Chimeras, man, Lilo is stemming against this defeat and it seems to be working, but how to deal with the Dryads? Exactly, yeah, this is always the problem with Figo Chimeras. He's going for his own Dryads to counter them. Super quick dispels from Neutron <laughs> against the Entangle. Oh, gets another bear here. Neutron still at 1300 gold, that's not too bad. He has a lot of bases, of course. Panda saved with an Invo Potion. The Chimeras were diving a little bit too deep. Oh, and that's big experience now for Neutron. Yeah, and on the other, other on the other side, Bobby is now losing quite heavily. Oh, that uh, was 65. a huge detonator. <laughs> yep, that was amazing. So a lot of XP. Like if you fight Necro Wagons, you always get super high levels from the dispels. Is he gonna defend here? I'm not sure. But yeah, Lilo held. But yeah, he is on zero expansions now versus two of Neutron. And pretty much same scenario on the other side. A barely, a barely defend and... But yeah, no expansion left. <sighs> okay, we weathered the first storm. This is getting pretty crazy. Lilu has another base up, needs to be entangled. And then he has to fight his way out of that surround against... Uh, Neutron's force on the left-hand side, going for lots of engines of wind now, building uh, heavier anti-air, I guess. And can Bobby recover from this? Yeah, I don't think so, because Godfather is gonna go for the throats. We have still two red spots left on the map, which is also kind of rare at this time. But yeah, Neutron is now going for it, instead of trying to finish Lilu. And Lilu is trying to escape on to the other side of the map, I think. 
But yeah, let's take a look at the fight between human and undead. Okay, three wagons, the shop is gone, so no potions of mana on this panda. Doing quite some AoE here, but being slapped constantly. All the corpses unloaded, more skeletons, and not much dispel anymore. Yeah, it's it's just super snowballing this undead army once it's in your base. Oh yeah, there's gonna be more peasants, more corpses, more skeletons, and then once again more dead peasants and more corpses, and round and round and round it goes. Dreadlord is soaking up experience as well to reach these. Yeah, and on the left hand side, by the way, Neutron versus Lilo again. Oh. Lilo on 50 now. And they are not stopping. Yeah, I think Bobby is just gonna leave at this point because he's not hiding anything. Camera safe to the side. Yeah, that's exactly. No peasants made their way out. Panda about to fall once again. The main is dead, and that means also no more income for Bobby. Yeah. I mean, Godfather didn't get the most experience out of this. Uh, four for two. What's the other heroes? Neutron has five, two, and where's the third? Uh, three, Panda, okay. Almost four. So yeah, they're kind of even, but Godfather really needs this second base, which he's getting now, or second expansion, rather. So yeah, if Bobby is out now, then yeah, Lelu might get help by Godfather and get just saved by the bell as so often. For some reason, it's always working out, but might just be a little bit too late for that bell as Neutron is once again going for the tree. This expansion didn't mine too much at all. It's getting a counter kill, all right, but the echo advantage of Godfather and Neutron is massive. As Rulers is lagging, I hope he can come back. There he is. Yeah, I had a freeze here, but I'm back, I think. Pollen gets killed and a little bit more damage done. Neutron actually holding this expo on the left hand side, still on three bases. Most income yeah, in the entire game. Yeah, I think game. they will get the message now that Bobby is eliminated. Well, once the farm is gone, that should be it if we're not missing yeah. anything. And there yeah, we go. That's it, and that's pretty much the savior for, for Lilu now. Sick. Yeah, Neutron is shocked. <laughs> yeah, what? Bobby didn't say anything this entire game. Yep. And there was no scouts in the north as well, because they were so busy with each other. Yep. So, yeah, Godfather needs to scout and then decide, will he let Lelu die and try to go with uh, for the 1v1 versus Neutron, which is definitely a valid play. Or he can decide that maybe Neutron is too strong for him and then he would l help Lelu. So yeah, I'm very interested in what he's gonna do, but he definitely needs to scout. And we are already see the shade going down, so yeah, all very yeah. He has now two more expansions getting up, and th this would bring in plus one on Neutron in terms of the expansions. And Neutron is very low on gold, so 70 supply, 400 gold. Um, pretty much the same as Godfather, so it would be a quite even 1v1. Interesting, interesting what Godfather is gonna do here. Well, he's lining up an attack, but he's in no man's land, really. He's saying, okay, I'm here, I'm getting there, I'm trying. Okay, so he's going for the help, and yeah, like this is pretty much telling or saying that he's not comfortable against Neutron in the 1v1. Uh, because if he would be comfortable, he would just go top left, creep more, take more expansions, and wait for Lilo to be out, and then fight Neutron 1v1. But he's deciding against it, and yeah, this is nice for us to watch because otherwise the game would have ended in five minutes. Yeah, we don't um, want that. But a freeway is always interesting because it's always gonna last a little bit longer. But so far, and Neutron is not making his way home. He's fighting this. He wants to exactly, cripple Lilo. Exactly, yeah, but he should know that there's no way he can kill Lilo. But I guess he wants the XP from the heroes. Like, this is the most juicy thing that he can get. 100% all that right but yeah, damage. is it too greedy? Because he's on 59 supply and he has uh, 82 supply under in his main base oh, with Necro oh. Wagons. Okay, another TP to save the heroes. Neutron. And Neutron is not chatting, so he's not saying that he's gonna get 
attacked or anything. Now the portal comes home. Panda is here already. Massive detonate by that wisp yeah, as well. That was a big one. Level 6 keeper now. That's also helping, but no mana. Okay, there are a couple of moon in the back. But yeah, he's on one expansion and... Yeah, he's not chatting, so Lilo is not aware as he has no, no scouts at Neutron. And Lilo still thinks, I guess, that Neutron is in the lead. Panda's wow. dying. Neutron calls for the game. And now <laughs> we got a weird situation to our hands where Godfather could just win it. What? DK? Nope. So 79 supply is what they have to uh, what they have to beat, but there is pretty much no day because Lilo is on 100 gold and two yep. red heroes. Yep. And Neutron is on 34 supply, pretty much also nothing left. Like, yeah, very, very poor play here by Neutron. Like no scout after Bobby was defeated and then dropping down to like 50 supply and no gold. How can he survive this? The Tree of Eternity is biting the dust. Dead it is. He lost some expansions before, so income is pretty poor as well. And Godfather is getting super rich behind this attack. Yeah, like, he, like, Neutron weakened both him and Lelo so much that there's no... Ooh, there's the, D, the TP on the DK now. Like, this, I'm not sure if this is too late or if it's giving them more <laughs> room to breathe. Like, there's now one... Mining base for both of the elves against four bases of the undead. Oof, that's a rough one. Okay. Lilo is trying to build another base. Close yeah, like this TP, this was pretty much the savior here for uh, for both the elves. Uh, but yeah, now I, I think Godfather should just go 100 and go again, like with the full information we got. Because yeah. they will definitely team him now anyways, so if he fights on 80, his chances are just less to win the 1v2. Whereas if he is going 100, he can win the game in the next 5 minutes. Ooh, but he get, get, gets caught off guard again on DK. Oh, that's not what you want. Is that forcing a no. town portal right away? Solid save. Yeah, very close one. But yeah, he, Neutron, very good job here in buying time, being aggressive here, out on the map. So yeah, he's buying time for both uh, him and Lelo at the moment. Lelo is getting up new expansions, getting up back his heroes. Um, yeah, he needs now definitely a scout. Like, he has a bottom, so he should have an owl. But yeah, the DK here again, Bruce, and has again to TP. And now we see the big disadvantage of the Undead Army, as we say so often. The Necro Wagon's just super slow moving over the map, very, very strong once they arrive, but he is losing a lot of time now, because time, if you are in freeway and you are the strongest, is pretty much the biggest factor, like you have to be super fast. Okay, that's the beauty of FFA, every game can still be saved somehow. As exactly, exactly. As we're approaching $3,200 for the prize money for the Wall Street Champions Finals, good job everybody! Yeah, and I think, yeah, that's definitely the window gone for Godfather, I think. Like, now the elves are back to... I'm overall five bases, I think, and Godfather lost another base to three ends. So nice play, also Lilo being aware he has to uh, be aggressive. And yeah, we have a freeway. I think there is no chance now for Godfather to close it out. All right, he still has 2,800 gold. Maybe he can go for one big attack. He does go towards Lilo. That base is toast, but there's another one coming up already on the left-hand side. Yeah, I was really worried that the game will end after Neutron wrote GG because Neutron is a player that can definitely leave if he's just if he saw that Lilo is down and he is on 20 supply himself losing tier three. But no, he didn't, and he made he get he got the DK to TP. So yeah, very interesting game state now. Yeah, always focus on the DK. Potom saved nice last save. second. Okay, where is Godfather going to now? Is he going on Lelo? Is he going on Neutron? And I think he decides going on Neutron. Well, Lelo, Lelo is doing a great job in taking out all the expansions of Godfather. Like, he is doing what he can with the little he has. And yeah, uh, getting rid of these Acolytes is also a big XP boost. So, 5-4-4 for him as well. And yeah, now there are 
two pandas for the elves, so that's very good against necro wagons. But it's so little. And yeah, Neutron is doing a great job here in just dancing around and using the spells to always get rid of some stuff. And yeah, level three panda, of course, uh, level three breath of fire is amazing. DK. And again, the DK getting low. Exactly, saved by an invo potion. Hero focus is real. Always gotta have this prepared. Spell shield activated against the coil. But Panda still in a bit of trouble. And now he's maneuvering himself into a weird position where he can't kite from anymore. Drunken Ace, Breath of Fire, Fried Fiends on the menu. Wow, yeah, a lot of them. And Lilo is doing the best thing he can. Like, he is taking out all the expansions of Godfather and getting up his own expansions, getting experience by creeping and letting the other two fight. So everything is going for Lilo here at the moment. Um, and yeah, he is. 50 and getting up some expansions again and yeah Lilo was creeping as well I don't know if uh, Newton doesn't need more support but Lilo is getting further ahead yeah, if we look at the supply we see 70 versus uh, 70 for Newton versus 58 for Godfather so I think he Ooh. should be in a very fine spot because he's also level 7 5 and 3 and there's no okay sorry oh um, Caught him, nuked again, but saved again. Yeah, and the mountain shines are a great choice here by Neutron, soaking up a lot of damage. Oh, two heroes! Yeah, again. DK dies! No. What? He had the TP! Yeah, yeah. And the Owl of Lelu <laughs> sees everything like you win him, okay, yeah. I don't need to help you. Yep. What a fall yeah. from grace! Ooh. And these necro wagons are feeding so much XP. Look at the hero levels of of Neutron now: seven, six, four. Sick hold. Yep, all these skeletons all gonna die. Panda level Yeah, very six well defended. Seven. So, isn't the next question how does Lelu kill Neutron because the zeros exactly. are getting so strong? And he is already on him. So yeah, that's it for the piece. Backstab. <laughs> They so, were so close of dying both, and now they're already backstabbing each other, so... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's how fast. Oh, Lilo is a rat if he needs to be. Yeah, and the good thing for him, he's on 41 supply and is getting back a very decent bank already. He's rich. 2600, 1, 2, 3, 4 bases. But here comes the Wrath of Neutron. Oh, Neutron is, is hiding some army already. Oh damn, four chimeras. So does this give Godfather some time to rebuild? A town is under siege. Yeah, like Lelo is definitely not on Godfather anymore. Like the new target is Neutron. And Neutron knows that Lelo is on 50, so he has definitely get to rid of some expansions. Uh, but yeah, Godfather is... Wow, 96 supply. I totally missed it, sorry. Oh, yeah, he had a big bank and he could invest into one more huge army. And now with Gargs, this is getting a little trickier. Every time I cast an, AF, an FFA, but I but I say this again, there's no game like the other. This is so yeah, wild. Yeah, that's the beauty, right? That's so cool. I've never seen a game like this. Also, the communications yeah. now between Newton and Lelu is so interesting. Who backsteps who? When are they working together? Yeah, it's, I'm not sure if Newton is needing help, but I mean, Lelu, look at him. He is... That's the best thing that can happen for him, like... Him sitting back, not getting attacked, even though he's 50, because usually he should get attacked. Uh, but Godfather is going for the throat, like he wants Newton out. Um, question is, is he? Yeah, now is the question is Godfather now winning the 2 versus 1? Or the 1 versus 2 on him? Yeah, I mean, Lino isn't helping here. Maybe he's just letting Neutron die, but I guess there's a lot more bases. <laughs> and now it's, of course, we again, right? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, 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 obviously. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, sure. Oof, Lilo is so rich, but he has no army at all. It's just the heroes. Yeah, Lilo is now getting back to infrastructure. Finally, three new engine of winds and a second engine of lore. 
So yeah, buying time it is for him at the moment. But yeah, he sees that he is getting attacked soon and doesn't want to lose his main base again. So he's going over 50 himself now, which give Newt gives Neutron a little bit of additional time. To rebuild, of course, as well. Scouts going on on all sides. Treants, Wisps, Owls, Shades. And now Godfather is going for Lelu, who started to build this army maybe a tad too late. Yeah, he just got up the infrastructure for it. And of course he would have liked more time on 50, but yeah, not allowed. Here by Godfather, stepped out the panda in time. And not too many wound mills up yet again already. Uh, so yeah, he definitely needs to need some help and he's already going with the GG oh, man. on it because there is no help coming. Um, so yeah, Neutron coming now. Oh, and yeah, I think with two, they should be able to defend. Okay, if Neutron is in time here, the Panda did a wonderful job. Shredder falls. Way, it's, always it's always interesting if Neutron should go for Godfather's expansion rather than just helping here, of course, because then both Godfather and Lelu would, would lose more and Neutron is getting ahead more. Panda was wiped out immediately. Such an important hero, not getting any XP. Wow, Tranquility as so well, and the AoE damage is just completely off the charts. What is this game? Yeah. Yeah, and Godfather back, back to Stone Age, I would say, like 61 supply, and off the map uh, where the elves have all the expansions, and yeah. Well, he got one of the two attempt failed, so yeah, let's see how it's going from here now again. He still got three gold mines, around 16,000 gold in them, and he's mining. Lelo on three bases, four bases actually, Neutron on three bases, and then no overwhelming army, but Neutron with crazy hero levels. Actually Godfather as well. Yeah, and now it's time to get it uh, to the markets. Staff of Silence, Ooh. great item here for Neutron. He is known to be very good with it in the usage. Oh, he got two spell shields as well. Okay, so I just read that Godfather is offering peace to Lelu. Wow, and you're I reading think... chat now. Uh, yeah, exactly, exactly. Unbelievable, Rulas. Yeah, you're getting better and break. better every week. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, thank you. I'm learning. <laughs> so Lelu getting close to level 6 and also close to level 5 Potem. But yeah, still, he is quite far behind in hero levels. But yeah, he is in a very good spot because he's not getting teamed and he is again on 50. Sneaky, sneaky. Okay, interesting if Lelu is following Godfather's uh, suggestion to backstab Neutron again. Yeah, like, Lelu just doesn't want to get attacked. Like, he is doing everything for it. As long as it doesn't lose him the game. And yeah, he's getting back. And another two Ancient of Winds, more Moon Wells, so... Yeah, exactly where he wants to be. His opponents are losing bases. Unbelievable. The survival skills of this kid. Well, all out war between Neutron and Godfather. And we will get a peaceful situation. Man, Lilo is also mining in no upkeep for so long. Yeah, it's an amazing window for him here. But yeah, now Godfather and Neutron finally talking about piecing. Because yeah, I mean, it's all time for Lilo where they fight and don't kill each other fully. Yeah. And yeah, they, they are not able, they will not be able to kill each other fully without Lilo getting to 20k or more. So it's a good call to ask for the stop. Dude, how long are we online? For like 40 minutes or something? This is the first peaceful moment after the initial ghoul rush by Godfather <laughs> at like, if I don't know, four minutes in or something. Yeah, really cool game. Like, didn't promise too much when I said there are three pretty aggressive players. Yep. I said this to... 
Remo and Cubert as well, like, oh, you poor guy, you have to cast an FFA, Eric. No, 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 no. This lineup is pretty insane. This is gonna be good. And oh yeah. boy, is it good so far. Yeah, yeah. And, uh, Lilo is now uh, exactly where he wants to be. Like, he's getting up even some protectors. And he's still on 50, so he has to be very careful not to be too greedy. <laughs> and yeah. But really Sun tough spot here now, strategically, for pretty much everyone, because. Leo knows that the other guys are not too inclined in fighting each other more, so he's gonna be the next target, but is it worth to go over 50 for him already, or is it just, like, if he's going is it too late over 50, then he will lose a lot of his base again and will never get hero levels. So for him it's good to go for a long discussion about what to do, about uh, how it's bad if they attack him, or maybe someone else. But yeah. That's one expansion down. He's trying to stall a little bit more by by chatting. Nice carry and swarm. We're getting closer to a level 7 Dreadlord. A level 6 Dreadlord would be amazing. And now Godfather going for the expansion of Lelu. But it's still fine for Lelu. Like if if he doesn't kill another one, he is still mining the most. Like that's 30 gold for him. Yeah, he has 25,000 gold left in the mines, if that goes through. Could <laughs> you not wait five minutes before finishing, Bobby? Haha! <laughs> yeah, yeah, that exactly. changed it's, it's... everything! Yeah, I thought exactly the same, like, one or two more minutes and Lilu would be out. Pretty much exactly the same as in the sem semi-finals, or the qualifiers, rather. As always! As always! And he finds the way back miraculously. So yeah, Neutron scouting again with the Owl, Lilo's main. He sees that it's growing and growing and yes, he is 50. Yep. He still thinks that Lilo is on 4 expands, but Godfather took out 1. He's still going and on. And yeah, now Lilo's uh, Neutron scouts that this expansion is taken by the Undead. Okay. So yeah, let's take a look at the inventory. Now we have time yeah. for Neutron, for example. We have Spell Shield, Gem of Health, Staff of Silence, another Spell Shield, Pendant of Mana. Wow. He's really already. good inventory for for Godfather. We have a lot of consumables, but nothing really to fight with. I mean, a handful of periapts, and that's about it. Yeah, and... like Godfather pretty much spent his entire gold so far on killing people or trying to win the game fast. So yeah. No time for or resources for the shop. And on Lilu's side, we have Periapt, Spell Shield, Big Mana, Pendant. Also, not good track. like inventory wise and hero wise, Neutron is clearly ahead. Yeah, Neutron is now going again on Lilu, so he's not allowing any more sitting on 50. And the good thing about having the best heroes and especially having the same heroes as your opponent, you will win 80 versus 80 fights every time. Yeah. Also, Shredder killed. There's only 2k Lumber. Mm. That will hurt. There's a Shade in the base of Lilu. Yep. Yeah, Neutral makes the right call. You're not sitting at 50, my friend. Do yeah, something. Yeah, totally. And th that's the cool thing about FFA and FFA in Warcraft 3, like this... This upkeep mechanics are just so cool because, yeah, just really science what's the best supply and which stage of the game. Yeah, we had this already in the two and twos where Lolite was banking a lot of time. I had to think a little bit of the FFA games. Um, <laughs> definitely paying off there. Yeah. And yeah, so Lilo pretty much realized like he can't go on 80 and win a fight versus Neutron, so he would have needed to go 100 for which it was too late because yeah he doesn't have enough production. Uh, and so yeah, he decided to not build anymore, let his expansion die, and yeah, just go the route of playing weaker and with the help of Godfather. <laughs> no, it's pretty easy. Oh man, yeah, we have a little bit of a three-way with 
Lelu not necessarily participating. Nope. Neutron's yeah, base. Yeah, it's a smart play by Lelu because Lelu knows that Godfather can't let him die. Godfather needs to help because Godfather can't win the 1v1 versus Neutron. How is it always happening like this? Unbelievable. Okay. Yeah, but, but do you remember uh, the moment where Bobby died and I said Godfather can decide whether he goes for the 1v1 versus yep. Neutron? Let's Lelu die, takes the top left of the map. I think this might have been a better play for him. Because it was really like two more minutes and Lelu was out. And then I think Godfather would be way ahead in the 1v1. But yeah, already just told you, for us it's way better to have uh, to have a longer game. Oh yeah, for us yeah. it's amazing! We have a keeper with no thorns, by the way. Two keepers with no thorns. For the air Yeah, fights. that's interesting, because, I mean, I guess they assumed that Godfather is going for an acro wagons anyway, so no big use. Um, but yeah, maybe now I think might be a good time to reskill. Because now it's gonna be air versus air a lot. Godfather is growing quite a bank, or should be growing quite a bank himself, with all these bases. A town is under siege. Three running still in the north. Yeah, he got a pipe now and a pendant of mana and a Katka's gem. So yeah, all of these items are super expensive, but yeah, very, very worth it. And Neutron on 100 supply, by the way. Yeah. Uh, that's pretty scary. But scary for whom? Maybe for himself. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Lilo is building up a 50 food army again. A town is under siege. As another base has been depleted, or not depleted, but kicked. Yeah, like go, uh, going on 100 supply. At this stage, is definitely telling the others I'm gonna go one versus two. I'm conf confident going one versus two against you. It's not like he's going on Lilo and then thinks, "What? Godfather is going on me? <laughs> Why?" No, no. Like he is going here for a big, big push. But I'm not sure if that's the best call. Well, I can understand being a little angry with with Lilo. Being on yeah, no yeah I, I guess it makes sense because he's the strongest anyway, so he will get targeted anyway, so it's good to make something something with it. Like you, you can't just fight 80 1 versus 2, so it's pretty much always better to go 100 and deal damage. We can yourself and one other, so you force the other to peace because the third guy would get too strong, which would is Godfather in this case. So yeah, he's dealing a lot of damage here on Lilo. Receiving some damage only at the Expos, but got quite some gold to work with. Will he TP yeah. or will he f try to finish Lilo somehow? No, I think he's gonna go a lot on Lilo now and forces Lilo to peace. Let's just see who, when they are going to peace. And we can see top left, Lilo starts to rebuild already here. Uh, and yeah, that's a very nice spot for him because he is still in the surround between Neutron and Godfather and rebuilding top left he has a lot of money and yeah this is way better position here and still has 10k mine. All that damage in the main base. Neutron is also losing quite some buildings. High upkeep for both Godfather and Neutron. Okay, so Neutron is now TPing. Oh, that panda, I worry. Made, it's not working, but yeah, Lilo is oh. gonna lose everything here. Oh, yeah. Oh, he's not even getting the tree, is he? This was so close. No. no! He doesn't. Okay, and Godfather now on 100. Look at this, this is super cool. Like, now Godfather is suddenly uh, smelling some chances to win here because. He knew that both Neutron and Lelo killed off themselves. So very, very smart play here to go now on 100. Push again. So now Godfather is going for the 1 versus 2. Okay, carry and swarm, little preparation. Same with Nova. Yeah, only bad thing for him is that uh, Neutron is still on best heroes and 83 supplies. Yeah. So yeah, I 
Yes, he's not gonna able to fight him. And he's really freaking good in the one-on-one -on -one department, of course. Yeah. So Gosvar is saying go, but I don't think that anyone <laughs> will go on a player's forces are under anyone else than him. Lilo only one mine, otherwise no upkeep would be very beneficial now. We have Thorns Aura, we have Tranquility, yeah. Nova helps a little. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's now perfect army. Thorns Aura level 3, by the way, 45% <laughs> damage return. <laughs> and it's just crazy. You can pretty much fight Chimeras versus Gax. But yeah, very, very high level play, and Newton is totally right, like, he had to punish the sitting on 50 by Lilo, because otherwise Lilo is just getting to 20k gold, and as he is the weakest, no one is really uh, gonna attack him otherwise. And yeah, now we have 100 versus 80, but there is, wow, so much Moonwell mana, I don't think there is any chance for Godfather to break this base. Oh yeah, oh yeah, not really. Also, Death of Silence pretty nice, and we see the Entangle. Here we go. Hippos versus Gox. There should be no chance at all. Maybe the yeah, AoE. Yeah, <laughs> no, 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 no. Oh my god. The yeah. nuke is pretty good, but what about that Lich now? Coil arrives, but only for so long. Yeah. All the Barry apps in the world can't help. 1.3k HP on the Lich, but didn't even matter at all. And yeah, that's Godfather back on 72, Neutron back on 75, so... But Godfather yeah, also Godfather four is not bases. gonna be able. Go for it. He also has four bases running Godfather. Yeah, that's nice. Like, maybe he should have even lost more intentionally and dropped back to 50, because then they are pretty much forced again to, to go Neutron. But yeah, it's, it's maybe too risky, yeah. Whew, another calm moment finally. Yeah. A little bit of rebuild as well. Lilu not producing any army anymore whatsoever. But also no spread on the map, like no wisps, no zeppelins or anything. Yeah, not even a tier 2 for Lilu at the moment, not even starting attack, so that's kind of surprising, not sure why. So yeah, a lot of owls, and yeah, if there are owls on the map and chat is enabled, I think we are pretty much out of the quick win territory. Yeah, let the mid game begin. Completely. Let the <laughs> mid game begin finally. Exactly, exactly. Like we had some opportunities, especially for Godfather, I think, to end the game quicker. Uh, but yeah, if he helps Lelu, then yeah, it's it has to go this way, <laughs> as we know. Oh, another attack. Peace time is over. Another base gone. I feel like Neutron does need that base somewhat. Yeah, exactly. Like, Neutron has no more bases up. That's the only one. <laughs> it's, it's so sick how often all these bases died. <laughs> I'm not sure how often Lilo tried to rebuild this natural <laughs> expansion. Still has 8k in it. That's pretty sick. Well, the other naturals, of course, long gone. Potom has Starfall now for Neutron. Dreadlord still not 6, though. Very happy not to see an Alchemist or a Dark Ranger in this game, by the way. That would be quite annoying. Or a Tinker. No Tinker. Yeah, exactly. Two Elves and no Tinker. That's also <laughs> pretty rare. <laughs> we noticed this after one hour, by the way. So <laughs> this is, this yeah. is how much action there was. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, and we're already at level 8 hero levels. That's... Yeah. It was one action pack game we definitely had. But the hero levels so, yeah. on Lilu but, uh, are definitely needs the level six. Sorry. Yeah, the levels on Lilu are pretty worrying. Yeah, true. Like there's oh, there's one green camp left, which would give him double level five. Oh, sick! <laughs> <Finally>. <laughs> A 
Okay, but Neutron back on Godfather. But it's only 900 gold left in this mine, so not too much to gain. Yeah, I think it's smart to take out these proxy bases for Neutron. Because if you want to go for a 1v2, then you first have to make sure that there is no proxy bases on the map and then make a very full blown 100 in the main. Man, all of a sudden, almost no income anymore. I guess there will be no income anymore for Godfather if this base falls as well. Trying to rebuild already. Yeah, he's giving this up, no chance. Lilo constantly checking anywhere. Godfather is wiping out a base of Neutron. Pretty even exchanges between the two, but there's still Lilo mining and Lilo at 12,000 now. Yeah, I want to say that it's going quite well for Lilo, but keep in mind Lilo is dependent on another player. Like he yeah. can't win any 1v1 because they would just do 100 supply and yeah. <laughs> oh, and fight, fight again. Lich saved last wow. second. Oh, oh. Level 8. Yeah, man. there's no way here for Godfather to fight. Yeah, this absolutely not. Army. And exactly. He needs the help of Lelo, and now Neutron can push into the main base. So, yeah, really, really well played uh, by Neutron. No Bacarian Swarm. Again, pretty great, but Tranquility will help against that. DK in trouble. It's a Necro to be a little bit healthier. Might survive! Good retreat, indeed. Lich again. Oh my. Neutron really wants to do some big damage. Starfall yep, coming yep. in! And there's so many targets! <laughs> yeah, very, very nice. Lilo tells Neutron to stop. And yeah, he has the owl in place, so... As we said, Lilo can't allow to let anyone die here. Not Godfather, not Neutron, because his win condition is, yeah, to win in the long run. Because even if he goes 100 supply, he's not gonna win a 1v1 because his hero levels are just way too worse. And yeah, therefore he's going to help Godfather here. And Neutron in the meantime got back two expansions, getting up the third. So yeah, he has pretty much the most expansions to mine. And it's gonna be pretty hard for the others to contest them because... He is just very far ahead in the in the hero levels. Yeah, the hero like winning hero arena against what Neutron God is pretty much impossible right now, given the skills that Neutron has in the game as well. Yeah, and his inventory is just amazing too. Wow, he is everything he wants, I think, <laughs> on every hero. Oh yeah. Oh man, that's yeah, the keep is a little bit built of paper and the bottom. Wow. 775 on level six. Quite low, but he she has an invul, an anti-magic pot, and a spell shield, plus TP, so yeah, she should be fine as well. Crossbar on 35 supply. <laughs> trying, to, <laughs> trying to take out the space of future. Yeah, is he even rebuilding? Not really, at least not now. Yeah, Lilo is finally attacking in tier 3. Lilo is at 80 all of a sudden. Yeah, like, I think he knows that he needs to... That Godfather might be running out of gold. And, yeah, he can't allow Godfather to die, so... He needs some army for it, I would say. And he has already a lot of gold, and... I think makes sense, totally. Here comes a big army. Even crows involved as well. Oh, can he reach the... Him to the, for the DK? This is not the greatest nah, this, situation. This entangled duration is just so insane. Like six seconds on heroes. Gotta have an invul potion here. Entangle again. No destroyers. TP. Yeah, this is so expensive. So only one supply. Zero mining for Godfather now. Will Lelo take the fight? Not alone, eh? Nah, I don't think it makes sense. 
because it's 80 versus 80, so he will never come out ahead here. So yeah, I'm curious what Lilo's plan is. But yeah, I think he's in a quite comfortable situation. Like I think he's he's able to control to navigate the situation very very good. And of course, we have to have a call. That it's a bad <laughs> yeah. game. I was waiting for it. We had the first one <laughs> after like four minutes or so. Now again. <laughs> Frustration is building up, and that's usually good for Lelu. Yeah, and Neutron, you shouldn't forget that you would have been out if Lelu didn't help you with his get with his goal. <laughs> True. Another base out mined. We're getting close to well, not really close to an empty base, but it's getting tougher and tougher to find a gold mine. I'm lagging. Ooh, yep. When Newton is right in what he says, but they don't believe him. He used his last 1k. <laughs> that Well, not that, but... <laughs> that the gold mine is running out and he's only down to two. Yeah, yeah. Being partially... Saying the truth is already a lot in FFA. <laughs> True. <laughs> okay, again, big Night Elf army. I guess Lilu has to save Godfather now. Yep. And yeah, there are two hours of Lilu, so nothing gets unscouted here. A player's force yeah, that's really his big skill. Not only this game, but in general. Like, Lilu with owls is scary. Yeah. And again, Neutron and Godfather trading off stuff. But yeah, Godfather is now losing his tier 3. He's losing his only hidden supply, so to speak. Oops. So he's on 23 supply blocked and... That's bad. He has a Wisp, <laughs> interestingly. Oh, okay. Wonder... If that so that's work, main like, gone yeah. of Godfather in the like what did they trade it for? I think yeah, two bases for Neutron, but there wasn't too much gold in it anyway. And yeah, now Lelu is going. Wow, Lelu is 99 supply by the way. Oh yeah. Ooh, that's smart. That's very smart. Death like, and decay. This... Wow. Onto Neutron's but... base, combined attack as well. Oh, was that all? Joint efforts now. Okay, let's see if they can I, I, deal yeah, with Neutron I, I can't Zeros. I how I like to play uh, Lilu now. Finding this way to, to go to 100 now as squad for the spaces down is Neutron will get two we want. But uh, not too much. Like, Godfather is already pulling back. He knows that he is not allowed to let Neutron die as well. So, suddenly, Godfather is in the spot where Lilu, Lilu Ami was this whole game. He is not allowed to let anyone die. And Lilu. Yeah, I think Lilu is. Uh, close to be able to win a 1v1, but there is still 86 supply on Neutron, so yeah, still not also, possible. Also a lot of gold. He's, he probably wants to fight to get ultimates. Yeah. But keep in mind that Neutron and Godfather aren't in peace yet, so Godfather is still in on Neutron's main base. Oh, he needs a little bit more. I was about to say for level 6 Ooh, Dreadlord. Yeah. Game changer. Definitely, definitely. But again, this is now getting expensive, running around with heroes without a destroyer against the keeper. So yeah, another TP gone, and there's not gonna be additional income for Godfather. Um, saying this, he is already mining again, <laughs> okay? Sorry. Yeah, with what, 1200 in? Yeah, and suddenly it's pretty close who is the strongest. Like, Lilo's on 13k gold, but still can't win big fights. Yeah, not at all. So that's quite interesting situation. Needs the help and of his again, base, needs instant reinforcements. Kinda yeah, asking Newton for just help. wants to go for the throats. He knows that Godfather was TP'd back. Alright, 
Keeper in trouble. Panda might split soon. Staff out. Panda can't die. We have wow, a massive Starfall star again. That pot of... Oh no, might just die to a Starfall. How ironic. Lilu's <laughs> pot him out, but on the other side, Newton's Keeper is gone. Or is it just uh, a bug? Uh, is that... The Brewmaster, level 8, dead. Panda is down. Oh. Here comes the split on Lelu, who got level 6 now. Only hero remaining after the fall of the Keeper. What the hell? And Lelu survives. He's up at 65, 12k gold. Got ultimates now. Yeah, yeah, that's exactly where Lelu wants to be. Like, both others are out of gold. And he still has now the big gold. And already the high heroes as well. And as you can see, he's pumping it. And immediately knows yeah. that's his chance now. <sighs> and see, go Lelu. I'm not sure... <laughs> yeah, Godfather is still on Neutron. He he had no shade in Lilo's main, so he is he's, he's low on information. Yeah, that was uh, killed before, like a long time before. And that Panda level 8 is so expensive. And, yeah, Neutron is now offering the piece, which is the only thing that can save him save him the game. I'm not sure if Godfather is realizing this at all. Yeah, he's offering, but he's also killing a base at the same time. What kind of offer is that? Yeah, Godfather has to be careful. He is ruining the the game now at the moment. Oh no. Yeah, Neutron isn't lying. Like, he's at a thousand gold. Yeah, yeah. He's allowing the panda to come back, apparently? Or not? Yeah, and th that's all perfect for Lilo. It doesn't matter if, if Godfather is killing Neutron or not. It's... Godfather lacking information. Godfather no shade in Lelo's main and look at Lelo's main. Oh my, that's a lot of chimeras and a lot of base in general. Oh man. Yeah, that, that's just where Lelo shines. Like always finding these win conditions, always knowing exactly when he has to be 50, 80 or 100. It's just so, so sweet. Like if he has the scouting information, he, he just plays perfectly. It's so nice to see. And now he got ultimates. Yeah, he's still levels behind. Not too far behind Godfather, definitely behind uh, Neutron, but he can somewhat fight with the huge army and he got that huge army and he can rebuild that huge army. Yeah, and Godfather is totally, totally misinformed here. Yeah. Lack of scouting. That whatever made Lelu so strong makes Godfather super weak now. Yeah, Lelu is on 11k gold and 100 supply and already really decent heroes now. Will Godfather find out about it? He sent something to the bottom, but he's not checking the main. He even has a shade. Yeah, I'm not sure what Godfather is thinking and why he isn't scouting. But I think he he doesn't want to lose the shade to an owl. So he, he can't go into the main base. He is super low himself on everything. Oh man, he's so stubborn. He yeah, constantly yeah. goes onto Neutron. It's another yeah. TP, wasn't really worth it. Yeah. And Lilo is having the time of his life with this game now. Yeah, definitely. Like, it doesn't even matter if Bossfather is killing any, anything of Neutron. It's just about that they are not 2v1ing on Lilo. Like, Lilo can win 1v1 against everyone now. Neutron's still fighting. Yeah, but Neutron has now a very good army. Like, he has Dryads, which... Like, Dryads, Fairy Dragons, which is the best against Chippo. Yeah. So Nothing Lilo really can't, can find, can't fight this at, at the moment. But yeah, I think Godfather totally misjudging the gold count of Lilo. But yeah, it's really hard. It's really hard for us. Uh, not for us. <laughs> for, <laughs> yeah, for us, it's super easy. <laughs> yeah, we, like we Neutron and Lilo both have owls, but uh, Godfather has pretty much nothing and is reliant on chats, I guess. But he should also know that Lilo was on 50. So how much damage can Neutron do now? Starfall, but no, yeah, exactly. What a waste of an ultimate this is. Going for the Keeper, a little bit of Tranquility, Panda in as well. He's just brute forcing the heroes right here. And that Keeper yeah. has to TP out immediately and Neutron down to 50. That was his last army. Yeah. I mean, maybe this helps now. 
godfather <laughs> that to realize that Lelu is very fine to leave. <laughs> Grats, Neo. <laughs> I didn't do anything. <laughs> Oh yeah, why, why Neo? <laughs> because I'm because I'm such a fanboy, you know. Ah, I. I think Yuri yeah. is a little jealous. I see, I see. So what is Godfather gonna do now? Like it's not enough to go back and peace Neutron. Like he has to be active on on Lelo. And Godfather must have seen the army by now. And Lilu continues the lies. Unbelievable. Even at that state. Yeah, and now Lilu is there for the moon wells. But the the shoes of life for the night elves. Not much left with that. Shades yeah, and now the shape everything. is there, luckily. Like, that's super important. And now Godfather should definitely realize it's super urgent. <laughs> and this is not even the full army. Like. <laughs> <It's your little laughs> <laughs> oh, Godfather with the paws. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, this is not looking good for anyone but Lilo Army. Yeah, and I don't think, yeah, I don't know if Neutron even has a building left. Like, there is a Wisp here, okay. but he has to be very fast because I think the bottom left buildings are the last for him. That's not great. Oh man. Um, we do have a great support towards the finals, um, instead. Thank you, Dubwop DP Mo, for three purchased profile pictures. That is amazing. $3,213 now. Much, much, much appreciated. So, yeah, with I was really wor worried for Lilo in this game with the spawning positions and oh, then yeah. Neutron going on him early. You know what? Nothing can stop parent. it. Never. <laughs> not even not even the worst spawning positions, the strongest one-on-one -on -one opponents. Nothing can stop this kid. Yeah. Okay, it appears to be our... Oh, there's one tree of eternity escaping. That's... Is, and he's on 400 gold. But yeah, inventories are very big. Okay, go try Neutron. Very fun for us now that Godfather is finally agreeing. And yep. Okay, now they are coordinated together, which is exactly what they need and their only chance to win. So yeah, now it's on Lilo to go for the 1v2. Pretty exciting. <laughs> First time in a while. Oh, yeah, not but there's much no left. destroyer for Godfather, so his heroes are very, very... Um, Weak. Fragile, yeah. Lilu doesn't have the bottom, so no aura for the units. Makes him a little weaker. Yeah, and he also doesn't have a bear, so no roar. Okay, they can do some damage here, it looks like. Okay. If they coordinate this well, if they use the spells well, death and decay coming through. Yeah, this is looking good for them. Like, Dryad's very, very strong here because his only damage uh, of Lilu is Chimeras. And the yeah, Anusian has the stacked heroes, the high-level heroes. Yeah. This was the last Ooh. timing they could have hoped for. Panda needs exactly. to split. Soon he's what? dead! What? No! Did oh. you see? He was just trying to split and died in the split pretty much. And now the Dreadlord, as I said, there is... Okay, there's the Imbul. Ooh, wow, losing the Panda is the most important hero against the Chimeras, I would say. And the one micro mistake you can't really do here, losing the yeah, heroes. But Lilo is now running out of Moon Truth, so Ouch. everything close to dying, I think. Starfall does a lot, also against the Moon Juice. Ooh, wow, this is super, super cool game. I really, really like it. What now? They continue... I mean, Lilo still has a base on the upper left. It's not that he's dying here or anything. He's still super rich. He, he can hide until the end of days. Sure, sure, sure. And Neutron is also not lying. He can't revive the panda yet, at least. Like, he can rebuild the altar top right. Um, but yeah. 
Then he needs to rebuild Moonwells and yeah. rebuild Hero, and he already sold a lot of items on the bottom. I just no way I for for real that he's getting it back. Like yeah. not before losing all of these triads. Panda comes in with the split. Was almost dead here. Godfather gotta be a little careful, but can't really prevent yeah. this to be Nice good. effort, but still 77 for supply for Lilu. Yep. And now he's TPing out with all the hurt units, so yeah. A lot of that really. is dead supply though, right? Isn't it like a lot of hippos as well? Um, you got 10 hippos. Yeah, yeah, kind of dead supply if you have owls, but still, if you... Like, I think the only thing that Lilo has to do is to scout the buildings of Neutron and try to finish him. Because then Godfather has no chance with his three heroes against the level 3 and Tango. Yeah, we all know how scary Lilo is with owls in his hands. He will find them. Yeah, yeah pretty awesome game state now because... Yeah, Lilo has a lot of gold, but he has no tech. There is no tier 2, so he can't... He can't really tech and get back Ancient or Chimera Roost or Ancient of Lores. So, yeah. Also, yeah, kind of tough decision uh, what to do for Lelu here. Is he, should he tech? Should he just go for the game where he knows he's the strongest of everyone here? For the base race with 10k gold? I think Lelu knows that he is going to win the base race. Oh, yeah. There. It if he doesn't create any huge misplays, for yeah, sure. Which he never does, right? Of course not. I mean, maybe yeah. if he has 42 degrees fever, or he's on drugs or something, yeah. maybe <laughs> there's a possibility. But in general, that is indeed impossible. Oh, he finds the tree oh, of Neutron! Wow, yeah, this was fast. This was kind of a bad position, I think, to place the tree. He has one more Wisps. A uh, wisp somewhere. Yeah, on the top right, he's he's going to rebuild. Godfather scouts this location, so <laughs> this is another bad news for Le uh, for Neutron. Not that Godfather is going for it for it now, but for later, he already has that info. And yeah, Lilo has the owls, so he's gonna have a lot of intel and already moving the sapper in the, uh, towards this direction and also his hippos, so he will spot it pretty soon. But also Neutron now. Attacking the base of Lilo. So Lilo, be it's a little not... bit careful, not lose all your trees. Exactly. On the left-hand side, he's attacked from the Infernal. He uses uh, attacked by Neutron. Yeah, Lilo taking out the tree of Ages of Godfather. <laughs> so that's down. Totally an uncommon yeah, thing Neutron, to say. Neutron is really out. Neutron is out. Yeah, those are the buildings. Those are the Chimeras. I don't think... No, there's no Wisp anymore. Oh, can he rebuild something somewhere? No! Neutron nope. eliminated. The king yeah. is dead. Long live the getting king. getting eliminated. He, he revealed the left-hand side place of Lelo. And there's already an infernal there. So I'm not sure. Uh, yeah, I think Lelo has too many Wisps, right? Yeah, he has the Zeppelin with four Wisps. Yeah, he has eight in total. Godfather also has three Wisps and an Acolyte. <sighs> Weird. Okay, how do you win this now if you're Godfather? This is so hard against almost 10k gold. Oh, I think this might be it. This might be the end. Oh, no, Rulos is back. A town is under siege. Yep, I'm back, but I don't think Godfather will be back in this game. Nope, this is tough. There's wisps pretty much everywhere. There's zeppelins. There's a lot yeah. of scouting potential for Lelu. Godfather plenty of items, but uh, yeah, Lelu just has all the advantages like his favorite position in the game favorite stage of the game he has a lot of scouting he has owls he has items he has high heroes he has army he has wisps he has gold oh and he might kill some heroes Ooh, yeah, if things go well nice kills. wait is there even yeah there should be main base right yeah there's an acropolis but also already scouted 
Ey, ey, ey. DK has a TP. Must use it soon. That will probably reveal where he's going. Yeah, I mean, mm -hmm. there are already hippos there. Oh, true, so. true. Yeah, it's it's fun, right? Like, it could have been a pretty quick win for Godfather, then it could have been a win for Neutron, but of course Lilu wins. <laughs> of course Lilu wins. I mean, this is a little faster than usual, but with this lineup of players, I did not really expect a long game. As we're on for like one and a half hours, I'm not too sure how long game time is. This might take a while, but oh my, Lilu finds everything at all times. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I mean, look at the Owl's vision. It's just so nice. It is. And he can have five, I think, at the same time on level three. A player's force is <laughs> I think they are level two. <laughs> That's only... pretty crazy. <laughs> yeah, two frost bombs. I didn't even realize there were some, but yeah. Well, now it's they're anymore. gone too. Yep. And Lelou is just cleaning this up. Yeah, the worms might help a little bit, put some pressure, but I mean, pressure is usually in the north. We have another fight. A little one. Spell shield, so useful. Focus fire yeah. constantly on the DK. Draining resources, um, four TPs and invoke potions, etc. But Lelo has just so much more gold. Yeah. Lilo is so lucky that he's not Pioc uh, Pinocchio, he would crash so many screens. You know, with his yeah. lies, because then it knows, goes through the screen, yeah. Great. Not funny for you, right? <laughs> <laughs> when will Godfather give up? He's scouting, he knows how much stuff there is. Like, what's his... What's his play to win? Yeah, his play to win would be to find the tree, kill the tree, and then he, he can kill heroes because there are no TP possibilities anymore. So as long as there's only one tree for Lelu, it's the only TP target, and um, Godfather should be able to to kill the keeper then, or at least one of the heroes. Oh, yeah, I think he now knows where the tree is, but Lelu is protecting it well. He's also building another tree on the left-hand side. So that's yeah, taken that's care of. Yeah, that's exactly what he has to do. And, and yeah, now the DK is hurt already and has to go into the invul already. Potom gets stepped out, but yeah, he knows where the Potom is, but ooh, there's a Zeppelin already. Oh. Get it. Oh, 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 oh. Look at this, this guy, 100 APM, but uses all the <laughs> actions quite well. Dodges the coil to save the bottom, also saves yeah. the keeper, and now back yep, to safety. In here. Yeah, like by the way, this, this is how Lilo could have lost the game. Like if he loses a hero here, then he loses another one, because there's only one tree up, and every staff is going to that tree. And now a nice... Yeah. Nice panda split, and that's more damage on the DK. Yeah, this was pretty much the last big chance for Godfather. What He's can he do? He's TPing to his Necropolis. Lilo has to move away. But there is another... Oof. Oh, spell shield, hold on. There's a Nova yeah. soon. Sleep. That's... Nice mana potion. But there's a TP, and mm. he knows the tree, so he has to run, 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 run. <laughs> uh. Okay, now there are two red heroes at the tree. Oh, Lilo, you gotta move! Wait, you gotta Lilo? move! Oh, what? what? That's the keeper what? gone! Spell shield, alright, caught him! Um, is... Wait, is the other tree up? Oh, the other tree is up in two seconds, one second. <laughs> oh, but not, not soon enough, he has TP to the other. Ooh. Getting stressful for Lilo suddenly, yeah. and there are no boots on the bottom, and he has found it. <gasps> what? Can he reach? Oh my! Um. Sleep. Yep. That's that bottom. Where's the zeppelin even? 
I have There's no right. idea. Okay, no more owls. There's now this panda is the only thing left, but how many buildings does Godfather even have? There's this necropolis. There's an Ancient of Wonders. <laughs> and 17 <laughs> supply. What, is, what are the two supply for Godfather? Uh, he has a shade and a wisp. Oh, he has a wisp. He Oh, it gets caught. That wisp is gone. The dryad, the Ooh. hero dryad in the south. There's a sapper coming in as well. Fine? Come That's oh. exactly No, not yet. He's trying. Kaboom. Ooh, <laughs> nice. The snapper blow. What? Don't tell me he saves this. <laughs> oh, so sick. Whoa, sapper so nice. and dryad. And he saves the wisp anyway. Man, Godfather is indeed... Like, he's, he's going for some plays here. Yep, there's still fairy fire on this wisp, so also not very nice. What the hell this game? Oh, but Lilo already prepared the backup altar and is yeah. reviving. Yeah. Ooh. That was expensive. But yeah, talking about how Godfather can win this game, right? Yep. Just like that. What does Godfather have left? Uh, uh, you pointed it out before. Oh, he finds the altar! Wow, he finds it! Death and Decay could be ready. Does he even need it? Probably not. No, it doesn't need it. Yeah, maybe it's not a lot faster anyway. So yeah, Lilo canceling now. He has to build another altar somewhere. Ooh, hoo, hoo. This is getting stressful. He's tacking again. No altar at the moment, but the panda is back. From the tavern, it's all about the bottom. Uh, the, the keeper, I mean, he's back. And that's the last billing at the moment, right? This engine of wonders. Where oh. did the wisp go? Did it fall finally? I'm not sure. Mm. Oh yeah, it did. It absolutely did. Yep, and that's the last building. Oh no, the panda, the split, nature's revenge. What can you possibly do? Level seven. LOL, GG, <laughs> Lelo is back on the throne of War 3 Champions, unbelievable game. Yeah. Such a sick game. Yeah, amazing game, like zero sitting, literally zero sitting. Yeah, I think we have... Like less, less, less sitting as in a 1v1, I would say, like, yeah. this school rush is pretty much a 1v1 timing. <laughs> exactly. Oh, <laughs> boy. After that, there was nothing, <laughs> no break. That was wow. absolutely terrific. Oof, time for a winner's interview, I would say. Of course, of course. Un like, what, what, I don't even know what to say. This was uh, a classic, classic Lilu. One of the, I think, faster grand finals we've had. Yeah, definitely. I, but I think it was totally to be expected because we have had three pretty aggressive players, known to be. And yeah, one smart player. <laughs> it was maybe the most boring final I've had so far. <laughs> because with it was these so three easy. players. No, because it just didn't feel like real FFA with these guys. They don't even want to try to balance the three way. They just play really, really stupid. Especially Neutron, as, as always. <laughs> well, you took care of it. Three-time champion. You're now the most decorated player right after Happy in War 3 Champions Finals. <laughs> really? Yeah. Nobody has more titles than you and Happy. Not but Neutron. Won. I think they, they won three times as well, maybe. N Neutron won two times, Sheik won two times, but you won three times now. Oh, okay, okay. Nice game, very well played. Like, how relieved were you when you saw that Bobby was defeated? <laughs> uh, I don't know. I I knew he was still gonna try to finish me, but at yes. least I stalled in my base long enough yeah, for like... to force him to TP. Yeah, it was a very interesting situation because I thought or we thought that it would have been better for Godfather if he would just let you die and play one v one versus Neutron. Because Neutron was quite all in and Godfather had an easy 100 supply. So yeah, I think this pretty much 
saved you. <laughs> I mean, of course, it saved yes, you. Yes, definitely. And and from there, of course, you played absolutely perfectly. Like it's always so cool to see how you manage the upkeep. Like you exactly know when to be fifty, when to be eighty, and then when to go for the one versus two. So yeah, it was another very yeah, very actually nice maybe. I think I should not have uh, defended at all with my cameras. It was a big mistake by me. Should have just gone for the base race at that point. Yeah, but I, overall, I, I mean, uh, there, there was one point where Godfather made a mistake by going too much on Neutron when you had this huge gold advantage, like pretty much after the last big attack by Neutron on you. Yeah. Then Godfather was still like two to three minutes on Neutron, and yeah, this this got you know ahead too far. How how he was so broke this game? Like maybe he just fought bad against Neutron or something. But from the minimap, it looked like he was always ahead in expos and stuff. Yeah, you know he he had quite a rough fight with his Bobby. Like he went with a Ghoul Rush, and Bobby kind of defended. Then there was Necro Wagons, and Bobby kind of defended. Uh, and yeah, he was on one expansion all the time, and then eventually he broke Bobby, and then only uh, took the expansion. So he was always low on gold and didn't creep. So yeah, also went I think over eighty supply. <laughs> so yeah, I really hate and... this map. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but you ma you managed you managed to beat three aggressive players on the worst spawning position on your on one of the. <laughs> least favorite maps of you, so yeah. yeah but I don't know how. Yeah. How could I even win that one on one against Neutron? Like he had a free expansion on his side, and I could never really contest that expansion. Spawn, yeah, exactly. and he even creep checked me in the middle for whatever reason. It was not his camp to take. <laughs> yeah, I mean, as elf, I think can't you go for the cross map expansion quite nicely? Uh, for the red spot. No, no, for the for the cross map for the top left, um, natural oh, yeah. expansion. Yeah, yeah, but I was assuming the human is of course gonna take it. It's next to him and he's human. Yeah, exactly, exactly. That's what I said too in the beginning, like in the very beginning, yeah. that you would like to go for it, but also the human has it next to him. So, yeah, it's definitely like you say. My my game plan plan was not to go for fast second expansion anyway against these guys. Yeah, like what was what was your game plan after you scouted your position? Um, well, I wanted to get as many meets as I could. Didn't really get... I think I got two. Not the entire first one, but anyway. So pretty much how it ended up getting into the freeway and from there be the best player? Mm, yeah. <laughs> wanted to go for cameras and not for the bears and talents like I usually do. But uh, these... All the players got, all got better micro than me in this game, so mm -hmm. I think laming was my best option here. Yeah, you found your win condition and, and it worked out very nicely. Yeah, but also got kind of lucky that they let me be on 50. Even though I had less bases, they still let me be on 50. Yeah, and I think Godfather really underestimated your gold count. Like He went way too hard on Neutron at some point. Um, but yeah, <laughs> very well played, I have to say, and it was a very, very cool game, like pretty much no sitting, we always had fights, <laughs> starting with a cool rush and then from there. Yeah, only an hour and 22 minutes, really bad for a final. <laughs> yeah. Why is it bad? It was super entertaining. It was too fast and the three-way was really boring. <laughs> I think yeah. we weren't boring for a second in this game. Uh-huh. Well, I, I was really bored. <laughs> wow. It's, it's not the favorite way to play for me. All right, so we need better opponents next time, huh? Yeah. Give me Gradient and Stein, maybe. <laughs> okay, we, we uh, tried to make this work, my king. Now we let you celebrate. <laughs> what does the evening have left for you more ffa uh, depends on what if the price pool is over 200 we might go out but let's see i think i'm just gonna play and then go sleep after that 
<laughs> All right. I can calculate the price pool uh, and the send to you after. But yeah. Yeah, what happened, by the way? I didn't find the Mazzarino page for ah, this it's, season. It's all merged into one big Mazzarino. Oh, okay, okay. With one on one, two on two, and FFA combined. I think it's easier it for makes the people. Sense. But yeah, guys, if you want th that the king can go out tonight and celebrate his victory, chip in if you can. W3Cfinals.backtowarcraft.com. All right, then. With that, we let you go. The three-time, three-time, three-time War 3 champions, FFA King, Liluami. Thank you very much. Yeah, thanks for having me. Yeah. Well played. Uh, yeah, thanks. <laughs> so funny. He just, just dominates this game, sits there. Yeah, I was bored the entire time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah, so I good. think he, he just... He just thought that they are a little bit too weak in the late game for him. Yeah, like it wasn't even a challenge, right? <laughs> exactly. Like, like what kind of a challenge do you have to raise to him? He had the worst starting position. He had the toughest one-on-one -on -one opponent. So, and still can't be beaten, this kid. Unbelievable. <laughs> but it's been some time uh, since he was our champion. The Neutron dominance is over for now. Um, maybe he can reclaim that spot next time. Maybe... Uh, Late game clash with Quest again. We'll see about that. Yeah, and as we said, there is no FFA like the other. And that makes it super interesting to watch and also to play. And if people want to see more FFA, then they're in for a treat. Because every single Monday, we have the Back to Warcraft FFA night, where we have uh, four players organized by rulers, casted by rulers and myself. Uh, for weekly FFA action, um, but if people want to play rulers, where could they possibly find out about the FFA scene? Yeah, I would say go to ffamasters.net. Ah, I almost yep. forgot. There we go. <laughs> I hope you have already bookmarked this, that site because it's just an amazing site where I type you it find in. all the information about the FFA and the community. Like on the top right, the FFA Discord link. And from there, you are ready to go. There's a basic FFA guide. There is There are all the announcements. There's a calendar of all the upcoming FFA events, like the weekly Back to Warcraft uh, cast. And yeah, ladder challenge. We have a ladder challenge going on. I think like over $500 going to the top three ladder players. Um, so yeah, go play some FFA on W3 Champions. Great fun, as you saw. Very entertaining. And yeah, hope to see you there. All right, guys. That was a long and awesome day. We've been here, or is it? Uh, I don't know. A lot of hours. We've had amazing uh, two on two games. That was pretty insane. We had amazing one on one games and we had an amazing first grand final. And if you're not getting tired of grand finals, I got two more for you. Uh, the last day of the War 3 Champions season 14 tomorrow, starting at 2 p.m. Central European time. We got Focus versus Sock as the one on one semifinal, as well as Happy versus Hitman. So much hype around that match and then it's time to crown two and two kings. Shao Kai and 15 Sway versus Law Liot and Sock. Sock has the chance to get two titles tomorrow if he plays it all well. So uh, maybe he has to start FFA too to get the uh, three-peat in one go. Would be amazing. Rulas, thank you so much. You provided an amazing uh, lineup. You provided great co-casters for the semi-final. You did a hell of a job today and always do. I thank you very much that you brought FFA to back to Warcraft. Yeah, thanks for this amazing season, like season 14 coming to an end for FFA. But yeah, already the next season has started and can't wait to find out who's going to be the next champion. Of course, right. it's Lilo. Of course, it's Lilo. We all know it's Lilo. Maybe he's getting sick, etc., etc. But of course, it's going to be Lilo. Thank you, everybody, for tuning in once again. It's the biggest War 3 Champions Finals ever. If you want to support the players, you can do that at w3cfinals.backtowarcraft.com. And we see each other tomorrow at 2 p.m. Central European time. Take care, everybody. Bye-bye. And all hail King Lilo. <laughs>